Well, Ford's latest legal battle isn't over cars. It's over some nasty words it had for a friend of ours, and that friend is fighting back. Ford saying in court documents that former NYPD detective Bo Deedle and his firm harassed its employees when investigating clients claim that Ford was stealing trade secrets. Well, Deedle is now suing the, co the car manufacturer for slander. Bo Deedle, we don't have to just look at pictures of him, we can get him live. He's right here with his special attorney, former special counsel to President Clinton, who of oh, course no. Bo was a big fan of as well. But first let's talk about the lawsuit, Bo. <laughs> Ford claims that you and your guys strong-armed some of their people like you were a bunch of thugs. How do you respond? You know what, this is a very serious thing. I'm not going to joke around about it. I, I'm offended. First of all, I've been in business from retiring from the police department 30 years. I've never had an allegation. What Ford did was Ford took technology from, a, from my company, from the company that I represent, Fasada, who has a technology, an app that's used by many of the car, car manufacturers. They took this, they were using it for 15 years. And they claim in investigating it, you guys strong arm no, some of their well, witnesses, they, they, right? They, they then take their technology from Fasada, knocked it off, and right. made their own. So what we were trying to do is find the truth. So we do an investigation, we're talking to people, we're interviewing, I have former FBI guys that work for me, former law enforcement, high-rated guys, and part of our investigation is always courteous because we want to get information. That's not we what they say. We actually had an Indian detective female that gave us the customs, taking your shoes off. So now all of a sudden they lied about certain incidents, they lied about my guys forcing their way in, they alleged that mm -hmm. I committed a crime, and I'm, at, I'm just incensed over it. Well, Lanning, how do they get away with making slanderous comments that they can't prove? So we're asking for to come to a court hearing and allow us our day in court and we'll prove putting former decorated law enforcement officials on the stand that those documents that Ford was involved in preparing are lies and then we're asking the CEO... But those documents, correct me if I'm wrong, they're sort of locked up by the court. The, what you're trying to do is get them public so that you can they expose are public. what they say. They right? were filed publicly and therefore they were immune from a defamation lawsuit. I see. We're asking the court to expunge them and to ask Ford to apologize. And I've asked the CEO of Ford, there's somebody who sits on the executive committee overseeing the whole software process that we say they stole from us, and that person who has the name Ford in her last name, we're asking for her to apologize as well. All right, now, folks who know the two of you are saying, how the heck did you two get together? You are on opposite sides well, well, of the political well, spectrum. Now, Has, is, is, is he turning you into a Hillary supporter? No, no, I'm going to be very honest. And this is a serious issue. I had to find the best attorney. Lanny Davis is one of the best attorneys. And you know what he fights for? He fights for the truth. And the facts that we were trying to obtain was the fact that they knocked off Masada's technology. And Ford can't go around slapping people around like that. Ford's dealing with Bo Deedle now and my lawyer, Lanny Davis. And we're going to fight them. And it's, the truth will prevail. Let By me the way, I, I, I understand. Understand, Lanny, that that Ford has a server, and you're trying to get the emails off of that server, e private emails that one of their workers would take. Is, is that right? Uh, I don't know, and uh, I've never heard that expression, <laughs> server. What is a server? Uh, look, this is the serious part here. Yeah. If Ford says this is not the case, that they were telling the truth about right. these uh, investigators for Bo, then give us our hearing and our day in court. That's all we've asked the judge. Do you guys for. ever talk about politics? Uh, well, you know what? One of the things that uh, I honestly said to uh, Lanny today, yes. I could handle I could handle Bill Clinton back tomorrow compared to what we have in the White House. That's what I said to Lanny. That's How about exactly Hillary? Well, I have no quote on that. This is not a political conversation. He's my well, attorney. we're trying to turn it into one. He's my attorney, and I'm going to be very honest. He's so astute at what's going on here. Right. And the fact of the matter is, you have a company Nobody has the right to steal your intellectual property. That's what America is okay. about. And, and you can't lie. Is, you can't nobody's lie. Nobody's going to convert the other one. Uh, we're, we're the odd couple, and we are happy to be friends. Even though he's wrong about everything, I still think he's a very well, you're both good outstanding guys. Uh, Lenny young and Bo, man. great to see well, you. You can take your show on the road if this well, doesn't work out. All I can out. say is Lenny has a, a spot for me at the inauguration, he said. I said, <laughs> of who? Of Hillary Rodham Clinton. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Melissa, right. over to you.